WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials finish up 87, NASDAQ up 8, S&P's up 21, gold contract up $15, 40 cents, traded at 1933 an ounce. We had silver up 24 cents, 24 dollars, 70 cents an ounce, light sweet crude up 62 cents, 96 dollars, 85 cents a barrel, notes and bonds. The 10-year note down four ticks, trading 120.17, the 30-year down a full point at 144.15. We have the 10-year right now, folks. We are yielding 2.64. King dollar. King dollar trading up 205 ticks at 99.804. King dollar is going for that 102 to 103 mark. Euro is at 130. Yen is at uh, 123.96. The British pound is at, I'm uh, sorry, the euro is at 108. The yen's at 123.96. And the British pound is at 130 to 1 US dollar. We get over and we take a look at the SP bottom line. You went up, you filled the gap in. Bottom line, couldn't hold price, and you did it with lighter volume. So I suspect what you're going to see out here tomorrow morning, you're going to be flat. You're going to be into lower price inside the futures in the SPY as well as the NDX. The NDX is really much weaker than the S&Ps. NDX couldn't even handle it. It couldn't even get to the highs of yesterday, the NDX. So bottom line, to be building some cars. You're going into a Friday. Long week, not a long weekend. Next weekend's a long weekend. Bottom line, you go, you're going into the weekend, though. The real question is uh, who is going to... Uh, basically bid up the equities uh, coming into the weekend. We go to the gold contract. We take a look at the gold contract out here. Gold contract needs more volume, folks. We're trading out at 146,000, 117,000 contracts. Bottom line, we're, we're talking like we need like 180 to 200,000 contracts to get out of this funk, uh, the sideways move. And I suspect what it's all about. It, it, gold's actually doing good in the context of where the dollar is. The dollar, you know, is at 99 790 and your swing area up here is 103 man and that's what it looks like it's going for you know the last swing area 10380 the the spike that we did the last time is 102 uh 992 so i expect number one you're going to get there the real question is can it hold it uh what has happened and this has happened since uh this is like uh six eight, this is eight years we've been in a consolidation inside the u.s dollar for eight years and you can see that the tops are 102s, the bottom's 89. Have a great night, folks. Have a safe night. Come back and visit Tommy tomorrow morning. It kicks us off 9 o'clock in the morning. Great show. Have a great one, folks. Have a safe one.